to the fourth round qualifying for fourth season in a row for the club. How about that? Yeah, delighted. Um, I, I, this this tournament is, is fantastic for a club like ours, um, financially and just getting our name out here and showing what we can do is is, is exactly what 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 we want. But now these lads again today, I, just, I don't want to keep saying it, but they keep doing the business for us. So I'm really happy, happy for the lads on the pitch to get rewarded, uh, and happy for the club to to sort of get some uh, get an affiliation with the cup again and that one step closer to being in the first round proper. It looked like we enjoyed being in possession today. How did you see today's performance? Yeah, um, I, I think we've probably, over the last couple of weeks, we've earned the right, where when 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 teams set up against us, they, they, they make it hard for us to break down, and Southport done that for 81 minutes. That they, we were, they were really hard to break down. I didn't think we had any clear-cut chances. Um, yeah, it, it was a tough game, and if it had been a draw, it probably would have been a, a fair result in, in all honesty because we never really tested them but I, I've said it again and I said um, Isaac Buckley Ricketts is coming up with a bit of quality some weeks it's someone else but today it was him and that's the reason why we're into the next round and we've just got to enjoy it and now we look forward to obviously the draw and hopefully we, we get a good one Talking about that Isaac Buckley Ricketts goal it's quite some goal at the end but the work to move into the box for him was Superb. Yeah, the, listen, the, the lads have really bought into what myself, Mark, Jack, his, everybody has. I've, I've tried to sort of do here, and we we know when to go long, and we know when we when we can play. And some of the patterns here were fantastic, and to get a finish at the end of it is, is brilliant. But listen, we, me, us four can walk week in, week out, and try as hard as we want. It's it's to them lads on the pitch to to make the decisions or to do the magic, and it's it's all credit to them again. And I'm just I'm just delighted for the club first and foremost to, to get into the next round and hopefully as I said we, we get a good draw and we can uh, look forward to that. It's another clean sheet here at Hague Avenue for you and the new management team and uh, how does that feel and how, how does that always come about here? Yeah well, listen we, we the, us four really have, have a really good connection where um, we speak every day, we talk every day whether it's having a laugh or being serious and looking at training sessions or watching clips and I've got a, a great great uh, support system I'm, I'm, as I think I've said it before I'm very 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 lucky to have the likes of Mark Jack and Kizza with me and um, they've got abundance of knowledge in the game I'm obviously new and I'm trying to implement my own things in it but to have them three with me is, is I'm, I count myself very lucky um, and that's all down to the club from for letting them come into the Jack and obviously Kizza have been here but bringing Mark in to alongside me to help me out and as I said, them three have been nothing but outstanding since I've come in here and supported me all the way. So we, we've got a great connection. We, we've got a good connection with the lads on the, on the pitch. We, we enjoy each other's company and uh, we, we try to get the best out of them. And uh, today was another, uh, another good day for us. It was hard to pick out any stand-up performances, but we did have to pick a few. And Luke Griffiths and Jimmy Spencer, Jimmy Spencer getting all those chances and Luke Griffiths sort of marshalling the midfield, as he I always does. Listen, every game is going to be different and every every team is going to uh, challenge us in a different way. But the, the two that you mentioned I thought were outstanding and Luke, is he just keeps going. He's like one of them wind-up things that just keeps going and going and going. And um, he, yeah, obviously he had to be a bit cautious with getting an early booking. Um, but his, his attitude and commitment is second to none. And it's a big mention to Ben Derby as well. Coming on and replacing someone like Isaac Sinclair is, is, is a tough ask. And he didn't get the warm up properly. He came straight off the bench because we needed to make the sub, and he, he was brilliant. And it was great to see him get more minutes. And um, hopefully that's the start of his journey now here as well, and he can start implementing his his, his position in the team. Talking about Isaac Sinclair, is there, he came off early in the first half. Is there anything to be worried about with him? Um, not, not at the moment. Obviously, um, it's he's he's put his foot out to sort of stop the ball, and it's it's sort of was a bit dangly, and it's pushed his foot backwards on his on his ligaments but hopefully it's a uh, it's it's just a strain and um he he'll be back in training next week but yeah it's uh, Isaac uh, is, is a big player for us so we uh, we want to try getting back as soon as possible with us going into the next round is there a particular opponent for Monday's draw um listen I, it's it's tough because you, you never know who you're going to get to so the, the chances of getting who you want is is tough but we just want a good draw for the club um, whether that's an, an, a big away team or it's at home um, we just want a good draw for the club and we want to give ourselves a chance to, to get into the next round everybody wants to be in the half of the fourth round proper
let's cut a see come Monday who we've got and then myself and the and the boys, the backroom staff will will uh, look for look to create a plan to try and beat them. Finally we return to league action next Saturday away at Box and how are we looking into that one? <sighs> I haven't thought about that one yet. Uh, yeah, listen, it's it, it there's no game as I've said I think every manager says it in their in their team talk on in their interviews, there's no easy games in this league. So um obviously enjoy today. We'll look at how books and set up. Obviously it's three G pitch is gonna be tough. Uh, but yeah, we'll do our homework, make sure we, we uh, set the boys appropriately and we'll let them go and do their magic again. Cheers and congrats, Mark. Thank you very much. Sir. <laughs>